Hi guys, this is the second video for the realization of a remote meteorological station based and controlled with you do. During the first part of the video, I'm going to show you how you can collect data from Arduino using PHP. Then I'm going to explain you how you can retrieve data using Python from Arduino, allocate them in SQL database and print them in HTML page using PHP. So let's start. Open the sketch of the last tutorial and edit it. Insert two new variables from the start of reading data. Cancel the serial print that is important from the sketch and insert a new if control for the reading of data. If data receiving from serial is Y, start the reading of data, else not. Now, compile the sketch. Download the library php serial class.php from this URL. Create a new PHP document and pass the code of the document, data.php.php, that you can find attached in the article. Include the library for serial connection between PHP and Arduino. Define the serial port for the connection and define the parameter for the interaction. Insert an array of value. Open the connection with the device, send a serial message and read the response from Arduino. Explode the string of value in an array and close the connection. At the end, print the value in HTML page. Open the terminal and copy the file at the path slash bar slash www slash meteo. Then open the page you have created. If you press the button refresh, you can refresh the page with new data. So, for use Python, you must edit again the Arduino sketch. Cancel the if control that you have inserted before and write a delay of time of 5 seconds. Now create a new Python document. Download the serial library for interaction between Python and Arduino from this URL. Download the MySQLDB library for interaction between Python and MySQL with this command. So import the library. Define a new serial object with the port and the bolt rate. Create a new interaction between MySQL and Python with database data. Initialize the cursor. Print some line of text. Create an infinite loop, reading data from Arduino and split them in an array of data. Create the query for insert data into database and print them on the screen. So execute the query. Create method database by phpMyAdmin and create a new table with the PHP script you can find attached.
create a new PHP document and pass the code of the document, datapython.php, that you can find attached in the article. Write the data value for the database connection and create an array of value. So, initialize a database connection with a specific database. Create the query and execute it. Explode the result of the query into an array and print the value in HTML page. If you refresh the page, you can find a new DACA detection every 5 seconds. That's it for the moment. See you on the next part of the project.